I'm here at New York Comic Con 2013 with Ben and Liam at the Made Fire booth. Hi, how are you guys? We're good. It's great to see you again. You too? So, tell me all about it. Like, what is Made Fire and what makes it so awesome? I know why it's so awesome, but I want everybody else to know why it's so awesome. Do you want to take that one? <laughs> it's, it's awesome because it's a brand new medium. It's, uh, it's words and it's pictures, it's everything we love. Uh, but we're evolving something that's in the digital space that's really innovating storytelling. We talk about this a lot, but we've, you know, as a as a race, we've kind of evolved storytelling from uh, you know daubs of black on paint walls and ochre yeah. uh, through everything, tablets, clay tablets to paper to films to everything else, and we have this amazing uh, opportunity to really explore storytelling in a whole new kind of arena, which is on the on the internet and on uh, tablet devices and so on. So uh, that's the, the exciting thing. That's one of the exciting things. Yeah. The other exciting thing is that we've, we've made a tool which means that anybody can make their own stories too and publish them to the, to the web. Um, so it's not just uh, an exclusive kind of club for the very finest, although of course they're welcome. Uh, it's, it's, it's something which hopefully will be available to as well, which will be available to everybody. So, that excites me. It, and you say the web, but it's particularly an app, touch screens. Yes, right? um, uh, at the moment it's, it's uh, well, no, we're on the web as well, we're on DeviantArt, so uh, yeah. it's a big part. I guess I'm spoiled now, it's on fine. my iPad. It's fine, a bit's happened since we saw you, yeah, we, we're all across iOS and then um, We've also integrated the reading and, and the tools into DeviantArt oh, okay. and online. So this, as you know, amazing, huge, uh, 28 million using community mm -hmm. that now has these books that we call motion books. Mm -hmm. So the Made Fire tools make books that are digital first, as Liam said, a new grammar and a sound of movement. And, and those push onto the iOS app, which you know, and then also into DeviantArt. Right. So, um, both places. And then I want to add, because you guys say motion in comics, and people have seen it before, and, and I know you guys are really humble about this, but it's different, and you found a way to... It's still comic -y. It's not like a little motion picture or yeah. just a comic, and then sometimes there's flash, but it's embedded in both, so I want everybody watching to know it's not just motion comics, it's... Right. Comics with an ele with like an added element almost, like a layered, like yeah. a extra plus or enhancement. I don't know. Pick a word. <laughs> no, it's good. Well, thanks. Uh, th there's a lot of there's a lot of um, you know everyone here loves comics and graphic mm -hmm. novels. I think motion comics were a difficult thing because they were videos yep. of print, and we're not trying to do videos. We're really sticking with books, and it's a reading experience. Mm -hmm. So it's very much something you read through and you trigger at your own rate. Uh, it's not it's not a video. So we're trying to make the best possible books rather than poor animations. So and it's not still and then jump to flash either. I mean, right. it's more. Yeah, we're trying to. Um, Dave, Dave Gibbons talks about it as really you're kind of acting as a cameraman rather than a puppeteer. You're kind of leading the eye and framing the story, and everything's in service of the story. So very much a book. But, you know, why would you just scan in print okay. when the world's moved to, you know, reading on a screen? Yeah. So we built these very elaborate tools in a browser to publish for screen reading. And, you know, we've been really lucky that we're funded by the people by, behind WordPress and mm -hmm. some really big, um, you know, community-driven uh, tools. Yeah. And that they understood this as kind of like an image press, you know, something which is about visual, visual publishing. And where else would you start, you know, in terms of a grammar than words and pictures, yeah. comics and graphic novels? Yeah. And then, so I know you guys have expanded to DeviantArt and other things, but there's original content too. Oh, yeah. And so people know, it's not just you guys were looking for something to sell money. I mean, you guys build the original content too. I mean, so talk a little bit about well, that, like the backgrounds and some oh, yeah, of the titles. I mean, and we are. We are creators at our heart, you know, yeah. um, Ben is very humble about it, but he founded an amazing company called Moving Brands, which really progressed, uh, but the, the, net, the, the, the tricks in the title is motion, it's moving brands, so yeah. they, they uh, 15 years ago realized that that was going to happen, 
and that branding wouldn't be a static thing anymore. Um, and, and in many ways, that's part of our journey. You know, that's <coughs> it was where he was with branding, and and where I was with with comics, and the two of the two two stories coming together. Because I'd, I'd done a bit of publishing, print publishing, uh, which is something I love very much. So we came out of a creative community. Our CTO, our technical genius, he's also a storyteller. He's an opera singer. Somewhere here, yeah. Um, so he's very passionate around stories as well, and obviously sound. And between the three of us, it was just a kind of perfect storm of, uh, of ideas and forward thinking. And, and the, we were just like really looked at the platforms and thought, Ben's, ben kind of phrased this more, most perfectly, he said it's smarter than a piece of paper. Um, and as soon as you start thinking that, then a whole load of opportunities kind of open up to you, or at least possibilities. Um, so really, from a purely creative point of view, it's like, this could be actually really fun, this could be really interesting, this could be like literally a whole new medium, which we started to realise it was. Yeah. Um, and once you, once you, uh, I, lo I, lo I love the Douglas Adams quote: that "Don't you shouldn't mistake the food for the plate." Mm -hmm. Great stories can be told in any medium yeah. if you view it as a, a medium in its own right, uh, and you know, put a, put away all the baggage and just have clear, forward-thinking kind of vision around it. Then it, it's very exciting. So yeah, to go back a little bit, we are we're creators at our heart. Um, we spoke to Dave Gibbons early on, and he's a very forward-thinking creator, always has been. And, uh, excuse me, I've got... <laughs> no, it's okay. We should do so everybody that. on the camera says it's loud out here. It's we loud. are in the middle of the floor. We're in the middle of New York Comic Con. Feeling it, hearing it, breathing it. It's loud and we've been talking a lot. <laughs> we should do. Loud. We should talk to you on the first day, and then we'll have a voice and everything. Yeah. Oh, that's boring. Then no, it doesn't look like so you guys boring. have been here. It looks like you guys came in, just did your spiel, and left. <laughs> Not, you weren't invested in your own. No, booth. we certainly committed. <laughs> yes. So, <clears throat> while Liam, yeah. so I'll, I'll help Liam try while, he, while he hasn't got a voice. Uh, yeah, Liam got Dave Gibbons involved and Bill yeah. Sinkevich really on the merit of his ta his talent and experience and on the merit of the technology that Eugene had been developing and, and the vision that we had as a group around doing something new. Um, but it was very important to us that we were not just making tools for everyone else, but honing them and publishing on them ourselves. Yeah. And, and hopefully starting off with some really great examples of motion books. And it, so, they were, not hopefully. They were okay. amazing. So, I mean, one, the passion you could tell in the art. Thank you very much. And, and you guys never mentioned that. You guys are both, all three of you are, are uh, contributors to the writing and the art, you know, in different yeah. stories that you've created. So, yeah, absolutely. trade off, but you're you're contributing as writers and We're artists. doing our bit. We're doing our bit. Yeah, we think and it's really... And of course, my personal favorite comic, which everyone knows always on the internet, is Mono right now. Oh, so wow. <laughs> I read it all the time. I didn't know that. Okay. No, he might know that. I think I was tagging him on it, like oh, right. on Twitter. I'm like, Mono's my favorite comic ever. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, Liam wrote it's that. Really, uh, uh, which is wonderful. Yeah, actually, Ben, again, incredibly humble. I, I, he, I know he was terrified when we launched yeah. because he was... It. <laughs> It's my first comic. He was in with, yeah. <laughs> you know, I've been doing it 27 years, and then to Dave Gibbons and Bill Sinkiewicz yeah. and no loads of other, you know, yeah. and then Ben. And uh, sickeningly, his is probably the favorite of everyone. <laughs> yeah, and it's been received well, yeah. because you talked about launch, and that was, that was last year. Yeah. Well. You know, so last year it was just the original content, and it was really good and really, very well received. And, and um, I mean, just the content you guys produced was amazing. Yeah. It's, it's quality stuff, and not just mono, all of the titles. But the growth has just been... It's been very exciting. Uh, so yeah, we did. I think we've done 12 titles that we've been rolling out as Made Fire. We, we think of that as our own uh, publishing arm. Yeah. And then, so some of the team are mapped onto our own IP and our own publishing stories. And then a lot of the team are mapped onto how do we build the tools out so that other people can make content, both creators on DeviantArt and so on, as well as publishers. So we've been signing up publishers which I could come to, but we have IDW on board with Star Trek and Transformers, and we're making lots of publishing. My Little Pony. So My Little Pony, which everybody... Because that announcement was done at San Diego Comic Con, right? It was San Diego, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and it's all rolling out every week now. 
which is which is great because we want to have you you know new material as well as established material to help raise the new material and grow the overall uh, yeah. marketplace. So yeah, we're, but we're carrying on with our own IP alongside bringing in some basically all the big publishers. And then now you have to read My Little Ponies. A and bit. we have My Little Pony, so and we're all Are you guys doing the arts on that? No. <laughs> yeah, no, we, and we, we go did, come we with coloring book. <laughs> I did a Moni. Yeah, a Mono Pony. Captain, Captain <laughs> oh, Stoney. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> See, we're very clever like that. <laughs> Dave did a treatment pony, I don't know why he... <laughs> it was very funny, D Dave at San Diego promised to do fan art when My Little Pony launched and, uh -huh. he, and he delivered, he delivered. Did he? In fact, he delivered too well, we're like, oh sh shit. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to see that, so. Yeah, really good. And so all the artists did one, Dave Kendall, um, he did anyway. a really scary ring one. He did a ring pony. You guys just did like an array of different yeah. ponies. That's amazing. And that would be really good fun. IDW being amazing, very forward thinking, super supportive of like digital first. No, Same look, with it's Boom. Right behind us now. My little there ponies, everybody. There you go. But, uh, <laughs> and uh, you got Transformers and Star Trek somewhere here. There we go. Yep. And uh, Paramount and Hasbro have been really supportive. So this move into digital, you know, it's got its. Um, you know, things take time, but I think it's really yeah. starting to, uh, to, to to transition really with a lot of momentum now. Yeah. Um, and we're feeling that, and this con is, re is really manifesting that. We've got lots of publisher announcements as well as making the tool open over the next uh, few weeks. So. Oh, in a few it's weeks? Been, yeah. It's been so nice as well as um, show to have real from Mayfire fans turning around. See, we're literally in the middle of Comic-Con. <laughs> There's a train apparently coming through. There you go. <laughs> but I guess you're right, because last year it was more telling people about it. Yes. And in just right. a year, you know, there's lined up the fans, the people understanding, knowing yeah. the stories, and asking, and um, so is there still some element of showing the tool and how it works to people, or do you think it's spread so well that people are asking less about that? No, I think we've got to be honest that there's a, we're, we're thrilled like how many people know about it you know you're saying oh do you want to see this and they're like yeah I've got it I read it it's like, great <laughs> but there's still like it's like a fraction of right. the people that we would we would right. like to reach and that we hope would care about this so it's really st we still feel like we're kind of just starting but I do I do think that the UGC user generated and, and halo properties if you like together yeah. will, will uh, es escalate it's already started with the my little pony stuff where you know people want to find things that they're familiar yeah. with as well as new things it's important mix. and then it could be you know part of the wording because just the term like motion comic they've already seen them yeah. and I'm not you know naming names and not judgment things just reality a lot yeah. of the companies that were doing that last year aren't here this year yeah. so it, it's it's a formula that hasn't really worked out so well, there's probably noticed. an element of people hear motion comics and assume it's you know that like flash type movie that's true it type gets scanny got a bad rap as uh, video, bad videos really and then um, you're right a lot of people aren't here I mean we've been very fortunate that we you know we have to remain funded because we're basically very much about producing tools for people and you know so I mean we've been very fortunate in raising our next round of uh, finance which means we can really uh, focus on building the team and, and with, with uh, if you like uh, visibility of like how the next couple of years look and how we can scale you didn't have visibility at the Apple conference or anything? No, 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 no. Their logo was like on Everywhere. the screen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was. It's only the Apple oh, conference. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. Apple have been very good to us. But I guess you're right. People may not have known what there that There will be around. Was, yeah, still, yeah, I think we've yeah. had great exposure. You're right. I'm also talking about, I think people are suspect about will you be around next year, you know? Mm -hmm. and, 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 you know, we're now in a position where we've proven enough that we can really scale this and that's yeah. it's a privilege it's, and it's going to be exciting and I think things are going to change really quickly in the industry. Yeah. I think so too because I mean you can even see it in one year the vendors here there, there aren't as many last year there seemed to be an influx yeah. of web appy type comics that yeah. weren't just you know a scan image which is also good I mean that's its own thing yeah. and you're not seeing that anywhere this year right. so that in itself is just showing that you're doing something that's working. It's got to be authentic, you yeah. know. But I think we were actually quite successfully landing uh, the term motion books as opposed to motion comics, you know. Uh, we're seeing it being used by lots of other people in uh, referring to their own work and yeah. uh, like, si With similar that same layered thing that yeah, you guys so did? Oh, you're already getting copied? That's no, no. a compliment right now. That's a compliment. We're fine with that. Yeah, yeah, we're yeah. fine with that. 
you know, it's brilliant. the it's more the really better, good. really. Yeah, we, okay. just, I mean, we believe it. It all proves the point that you yeah, know, there's good. an audience for it. Yeah. Yeah. It's the same as, um, I, I think it's really, things like Boom Studios appearing over the last few years and staying shows that we're in a really healthy marketplace at the moment. Yeah. They're like print as well as digital. So, and they've been great. They're, they're totally, they're, they're signed and on board and they, Ross Ritchie and co have been really supportive of this digital first material. Same with Top Cow and uh, ITV Studios who are a British broadcaster who came on board. So we, we, we're having a lot, a lot of fun with them. It's, it's nice when people, you know, understand it and start to believe in it and, and, yeah. and don't confuse it all the time with, with things we don't stand for. So, right. I think there's a lot to do there, you know. Yeah. Motion right, books. There's no word for it. You no, gotta no make word. it up, right? That's why we, we <laughs> that's why we the use word. the term motion books because we wanted something yeah. that my mum would understand. Yeah. It's like it's a book, but it's in some kind of motion. So right. whether that's a really useful term or not, we'll, we'll see. But it, it kind of helps people get their It'll head become around. Become one, it. you know. We'll you guys, I don't I don't anticipate you guys going anywhere and. <laughs> I mean, so it'll become the word. But I hope it'll just be books down the line, you know. Might. Yeah. Uh, who knows? We'll see. So where can everybody find all this information and get these comics, whether it be the deviant art, the original content, or the signed or the the name content? Well, I, I, everything's dropping into the same. We think of it as our marketplace for yep. motion books. So you've got IDW, Transformers, Star Trek, etc. You've got Captain Stone, Treatment, Mono. You've got UGC that we just launched with some early creators using the tool team here, in fact, uh, from Scotland who've just launched their Walk Don't Run. So all of that material is on the Madefire app on iOS, which mm -hmm. is still, I think, the best rated app in books, which is great. Is it the best? Yeah, yeah it's, it's got an amazing five-star rating. It is. It's, it's such an easy interface, you know. Yeah. And I say that because sometimes I've read the, um, you know, more of the PDF web-enabled yeah. comics because I couldn't find it in the comic store or whatever. I'm on yeah. the go. And it's, it's simple, but it, it's, it's weird how there's motion in your content and it's still easier than some of just the web scan comics. I mean, it's very easy to use. You can share. There's a share feature. Yeah, yeah. It's just a very friendly, flowy You know more than we interface. do about this. It's because I actually read it. <laughs> you, you know all this stuff. You guys wrote all this stuff. No, but I love it. It's from the end user. Like, you probably... Yeah designed it that way but it, it, totally. it does work that way thank you and the sharing for example so being on iOS is amazing because it's such such an elegant way to, to, mm -hmm. to consume but being on the web is so important of course because not, every, not everyone's on iOS and it's very important that you can share and and, yeah. and, and uh, kind of um, freely uh, socialize uh, and obviously the web's brilliant you can share links and all that so for us web and iOS is our focus and the DeviantArt community you know the team there, Angelo and so on. Uh, we're just, you know, we're integrating more and more every week with them in terms yeah. of putting the reading experience and the tools there. Yeah. We, it couldn't be better for us. We're very lucky that we're rolling with them. So, madefire.com and... Yes, I'm sorry, madefire.com, madefire app. I want them to read it, because yeah. it's good. You guys yeah. need to read it. Yeah, please I mean, read the it. They're all good. I mean, not just so the stories, but, you know, the, the images, yeah. the art, like, all of it's really good. Yeah, as Liam's saying, there's a motion books section now on DeviantArt. So there's a whole okay. motion books area, which is in the global navigation on DeviantArt.com. You go to MadeFire.com or MadeFire, the app on iOS. Okay. Great, so I look forward to hearing more stories and seeing you guys again. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Yeah, lovely, thank you.